Hello guys, welcome back to LineUp. For today's video, we are going to show you or discuss for you how to work on Outlayer AI. So if you're interested, let's get started. So you might be wondering, how do you start working here in Outlayer AI? What is Outlayer AI here? And is it a great idea to start working here in Outlayer AI? So first, let's go and discuss what is Outlayer AI. So Outlayer AI is basically a platform that connects people like you and me with jobs that involve training and improving artificial intelligence intelligence models. So think of it as a bridge between everyday human input and the next generation of smart technology. Now you're not working for just one big AI company. Outlayer contracts with major tech companies like OpenAI, Google, or other startups who need real people to evaluate, test, and improve their AI system. These systems might be language models, which in this case are uh, chatbots, virtual assistants, search algorithms, and so on. And that also includes ChatGPT. And here's the thing. AI doesn't get smarter on its own. It learns from human. Now, you could say that uh, basically AI are like children of humans. So basically, they learn from their parents or from humans specifically here. So why do jobs exist here in Outlaw AI? Now, the great question here is it comes down to the fact that AI still needs human judgment to work properly and in this case so why or here's the uh, why jobs are created so first is to train the ai so when developers build ai they feed it massive amounts of data but that data has to be cleared or uh, cleaned and curated and judged for quality you might be asked to compare to ai responses and see which one is more helpful and also flag him for or inaccurate content and also, you may need to rank answers based on tone, accuracy, and or usefulness. Now, this kind of human reinforcement is crucial for teaching the AI how to respond better in future situations. Now, basically, it's just like teaching someone what is right and wrong here and basically teaching them skills that they will be able to use later on. Now, also, before an AI model is rolled out, it has to be tested in tons of scenarios. Our layer workers simulate real conversations, ask questions, or evaluate how the AI handles certain tasks. Your feedback helps catch bag bugs, biases, or weird behavior early on. And also some jobs on other AI involve rating search engine results, evaluating ads, or improving recommendation systems. Now, your job is to tell the system that what's actually useful or relevant here, something only a human can truly judge. And AI models that work globally need local insights. So if you understand your culture, language, or regional norms, your input helps AI avoid awkward or offensive mistakes when dealing with users in your area. Now, why is this really valuable here? Now, AI companies are in a race to be the best, more natural, safer, and more useful. But building good AI requires massive amounts of human feedback, and that's where people like you come in. So that's why AI layer exists to offer an on-demand high-quality human input to improve AI models faster and better than relying on in-house teams alone. And since the work is actually important, it adds real value here, and they pay you with a win-win. So. How do we get started here on applying or how do we get started on working on Outlayer AI? So first things first is you want to go and visit their official web page or website here, which is going to be Outlayer.ai. Now, at the main page here, as you can see, you have two options at the top, right? We have login and view opportunities. Now, if you're already within Outlayer's uh, uh, ecosystem, you're already signed up, or you already have an account, you just need to click on log in, which in this case allows you to enter your email for your password and just basically log in into your account. But if you don't have an account yet, you won't be able to create an account yet as long as you don't have a job within the platform itself. That you can only create your account if you have your if you have like a project working on. That's where a very specific button here exists. So we have view opportunities. Now, the view opportunities gives you the list of available jobs right now or opportunities per se here, which allows you to see what is really uh, needed right now. Like, for example, there's uh, some uh, specialists needed uh, in French and in Spanish, and they also have advanced math expertise sought for AI training. 
And it also includes the following uh, job, uh, locations here, which in this case is remote. So most jobs here are actually remote, so you won't have to worry about it. And the countries that they're looking for. Obviously, there are going to be a lot of countries here. And you need, need to take in consideration which country it, this is currently available. So if their country is not available in this specific opportunity, then you may not be accepted within the platform itself. Now, the great thing about Outlayer AI here is there are going to be a lot of choices here. As you can see, there's a whole list that you can view in here and a lot more. Now, currently, as of this moment, um, most are looking for mathematicians, but if I'm not mistaken, they also look for uh, languages or uh, experts in language and a lot more. So there are going to be a lot of jobs here. Now, since this is, there are going to be a lot of jobs here, you can basically choose or filter them out. As you can see, you have 404 opportunities. Now you can basically sort uh, filter them by special uh, specialist, coders, generalists, or language. Now you can also specify the location here to see all the jobs or opportunities that is available in your area. So as you can see right now, a remote and that specific country here. Now if you want to view the details of that job, you just need to click on it. And from here, you should be able to see the job description, what they will be needing from you, and what they are expect or what they are what they actually expect from you to provide on this specific project. Now, as you can see, the payment here are going to also be discussed. So currently, pay rates for core projects work by English writing experts in the following uh, average around $8 per hour. So in this case, make sure to read all the details here so that you know how much you'll be getting for this specific project. Now, also, on the downside here is depending on where you apply here. Like For example, if you're in the Philippines, $8 is kind of small. But for other countries like the US, Australia, obviously, it's going to be a lot more. But yeah, just take in consideration here what you will be paid. And also at the right side here, they have an AI overview. Like for example, if this is a remote work, uh, the time here, if it's flexible, and what's the payout? So in this case, it is a weekly payout here. And also, it gets fle a flex your expertise. Now, obviously, I will really recommend you to really read all the details here. Now, go ahead and click on Apply Now once you're sure that you want to join the project. And once you've done that, it's going to ask you a bunch of details. So in this case, it's going to ask you or basically do a short interview for your account which in this case, you want to go ahead and answer that. So you need to agree a few things here and also understand that we trust confirm our information and confirm that you're at least 18 years old uh, age. And once you've done that, you can go and click on submit and sign up with Google or with email care. But in the following pages, you just need to complete the sign up, answer a few questions in order for you to submit your application. But in this case, that's about it. Hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to line up. Thank you for watching.